So today, we're playing Kindergarten. Um, I've seen a few people play this game on YouTube, but I've never, like, seen anyone beat it or, like, get all the achievements or play it how I like to play it. And, uh, the game is on sale, so I got it, and now here we are. Um, I don't know- oh, Monday. I don't know if the game's on sale now, I got the game a while ago. I broke the game. Okay, there we go. Yay, screaming children. Cool. How do you interact with things? Oh, I click it. Okay, okay, so I guess we'll take like two dollars. Oh, okay. Alright, let's go kindergarten. Am I ready to start another day of kindergarten? Yes. So yeah, like I said, I've seen other people play this game, but I've never played it myself, so I figured why not record while I play for the first time? Screw off, kid. I'm busy. Okay, let's screw off. Mm, I think this is Nugget, right? Hi, my friends call me Nugget, or they would if I had any. Nugget knows no love or friendship since Billy went missing. I'll be your friend. What is your offering? Offering? You must offer something to prove your friendship to Nugget. Maybe that's why you don't have any friends. <laughs> Perhaps, but Nugget does not make the rules. Nugget only follows them. Now please present Nugget with your offering. Who makes the rules? The principal has made the rules for Nugget. Why did he give you those rules? You asked many questions. The principal requests that Nugget gives this to anyone who is so curious. What is it? Nugget doesn't know. The principal is very mysterious. He also said not to talk to anyone who has it. Bye bye. Okay, so we got whatever this is. Uh, who are you? Oh, um, hey, I'm Lily. You've probably heard about what happened to my brother Billy. I haven't. You haven't? It's been all over the news. He went missing a few days ago. Sorry to hear that. Thanks. That makes you one of the few people that even seems to care. Ever since he went missing, people either ignore me or insult me. Cindy has been trying to put gum in my hair. Why? I don't know, but if I were you, I'd stay away from her. She's really mean. Thanks for the tip. Okay, I think this is Cindy. Hey there, cutie. I'm Cindy. Wanna be my boyfriend? No. Oh, that's all we can do. Okay, hold on. What if I say yes? Sure. Hey, that's what I like to hear. And we'll totally be the cutest couple in school. But first, you have to do something for me. Like what? You see that girl over there? That's Lily. She is by far the ugliest, nastiest girl you will ever meet. I want you to take this gum and stick it in her hair during morning time. No way. Fine, but don't come crying to me when you die old and alone. I won't. What happens if I talk to her again? Has the fear of dying alone finally taken hold and you're ready to put gum in Lily's hair? Still no. Okay. So who are you? Oh, there's another dude over there. I'm Monty. If you need something, come talk to me. Odds are I can get it for you for the right price. What I need and what I sell changes throughout the day. So come see me often. I want to buy something. I want to sell something. Yeah, sell. Sell whatever this is. What do you got? Oh, nothing. I can't sell that. Okay. Um, I want to buy something. Here's what's for sale. Yo-yo, cigarettes. Okay. Uh, voice recorder, screwdriver. Never mind. Um, yo-yo. That seems the most normal thing to buy off a kid. Yo-yos. Don't know what it is about these things, but Jerome loves them. You can have it for a dollar. What do you say? Okay. Pleasure doing business with you. New hint unlocked. Uh, I don't need anything else. How do I... Oh, hints. Here we go. This is the hints page. It will fill out as you play the game. You don't need any special items to complete Jerome, Cindy, or the teacher's missions. Okay, so the three of them have missions. You need to buy three items from Monty before morning time. Jerome will talk to you during morning time if you give him a yo-yo. Okay. So we'll give Jerome a yo-yo. 
You need a special item from the teacher before you can complete Bugs' mission. Okay. You need a special item from Cindy before you can start Nugget's mission. Okay. You need a special item from Jerome and as much money as you can carry to complete Monty's mission. So everyone has missions. You need to have special items from Monty, Nugget, and Bugs in order to complete Lily's mission. So, wait. You don't need any special items to complete Jerome, Cindy, or teacher's missions. So I guess we'll start with Jerome since I already have the yo-yo. Okay. I'm gonna assume you're Jerome. I'm Jerome. I don't think you're cool enough to talk to me. Whatever. Uh, let's talk to the teacher. I'm Miss Applegate. I've been well endowed um, with excellent teaching qualities. You sure have. Oh my god. How you doing there, Sonny? Don't mind the old janitor here. Just sweeping up after you silly cretin. Cretin. What the fudge is that word? Sweepy, sweepy, sweepy. That's a mop. Ah, so it is. You're also mopping the sidewalk. I'll be mopping your blood if you don't get daddle. I'm gonna skedaddle. And. Oh, I didn't even notice I have the yo yo. Okay, children, it's time to start the day. Everyone head inside for morning time. Go inside. Oh, good morning, children. It's time for you to pick your buddies for morning time. Or you can be sad, pathetic, and alone. As long as you're the best you, you can be. Let's go find a partner. I mean, Monty's sitting next to me. I don't know why Monty can't be my partner. Wait, I just... I remember. I think I needed more stuff for his thing, right? You need to buy three items for Monty before morning time. Damn. Okay. Well, I don't know what the three items are, so I'm not going to waste the money. Okay, so let's talk to Jerome. Since we have a yo-yo and he'll talk to us. Dude, you know you're not cool enough to talk to me, let alone be my morning buddy. Besides, Monty's going to hook me up with a sweet yo-yo. You mean this yo-yo? Ah, come on. He told me he was going to save that for me. You can have it if you'll be my morning buddy. You've got a deal, and since we're going to be friends, I think you should do something to help me out. You know, as a friend. Like what? You know that creepy old janitor? He stole my laser pointer this morning. Said it was too bright and shiny for his old eyes. I need your help to get it back. What do I do? When you're ready, I'll give you a hall pass. You can use it to get by the hall monitor. Once you're past him, head to the janitor's closet. My laser should be in there somewhere. Why don't you go? No way, I already got busted with a stolen pass before. The hall monitor will catch me no matter what. Fine, give me the pass. Awesome. It should be in a box somewhere. Just grab it and go. Don't linger there too long. He checks back frequently. Got it. Just let me know when you're ready and I'll give you the pass. I won't be able to distract the teacher for long, so head straight for the door. Don't talk to anyone on your way out. Uh, yeah, I'm ready. Go distract her. Run! Door. Alright. You're in my way. Not so fast, little dude. I'm gonna need to see your hall pass before I can let you by. Here's my pass. A principal pass? Whoa, yeah, go. Do whatever, man. Sweet. Now move. Okay. I'm gonna assume that's not the janitor's closet. There's something in there. Okay, no. Let's just do this. Stolen stuff. How the hell? It looks like the screw is loose. Damn, I don't think... Oh wait, there's another box. There's a note, a monster card, and a $5 bill in this box. Uh, take the money. It's a bucket that's catching the blood from that thing on the table. This would be... A truly vile thing to dump on someone's head. Take it. Oh shit. Gotta go. Hey man, you heard the bell. Go on back to your class. Head back to class. We have a problem. Well, did you get it? What? Okay kids, we all heard the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for our nutritious meal. I hear we're having slop today. How exciting. We'll talk at lunch. Alright, go to lunch. Simon failed. Get the laser pointer. I couldn't. 
Over here. Well, did you get it? I couldn't get it. Aw, oh, man, that's a shame. Looks like I'm just gonna have to deal with whatever punishment I get from this. You can keep the pass, I'll see you around. Cool, thanks. There was a screwdriver in the morning from Monty, wasn't there? Is that the other thing I have to buy? What I'm gonna do is... Oh, I can restart the day. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Yeah, Monday. How much is the screwdriver, though? Okay, I'm gonna just take $2. There we go. So we take $2, and then... Yes. And hopefully, we can buy the yo-yo and the screwdriver. So, Monty. Uh, Monty, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanna buy something. Here's what's for sale. And da -da, deal one dollar. Okay. Uh, I want to buy something. Screwdriver. Yeah, I knew I saw a screwdriver. Got this sucker off the janitor for a steal. It's weird that he's willing to sell me the tools provided by the school, but I ain't complaining. It'll run you a dollar. Perfect. Pleasure doing business with you. I don't need anything else. Okay, children, it's time to start the day. Everyone head inside for morning time. Good morning, children. It's time for you to pick your buddies for morning time. Yeah, 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 we already read this. Okay. Okay. Uh, it looks like the screw is loose. Yes! Use the screwdriver. Stolen stuff. I think we can get the laser pointer. There's a bunch of junk in here along with Jerome's laser pointer. Take the laser. And there's the bell. Run. I just noticed there was a sword up there. I think I saw a sword and something else. Well, did you get it? What? We all heard the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for finish this meal. Blah, 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 blah. We'll talk at lunch. Yeah, go to lunch. Hey, kid, over here. Well, did you get it? I got it. Dude, that's awesome. I just hope the janitor doesn't notice. He can be pretty terror. Which one of you dead little children went into my closet? Oh jeez, sounds like he noticed. You better hurry up and hide that thing before he gets here. If he catches you with it, you're a dead man. Where do I hide it? Um, the garbage can, quick, throw it in there. Good idea. Run! It's garbage can, I'm not gonna dig through it to find stuff. Hide laser. Woo, just as he walked in. Well, anyone wanna step forward? No? Well, what a surprise. What about you little junior principal I took your laser thingy this morning I'm sure you want it back search me man I don't have it so screw off or I'll tell my dad you peed in the water fountain again you win this round kid what about you you been in my closet turn out your pockets hmm nothing I still got my eye on you oh just leave the poor things alone you're always looking for a reason to impale a child on that map of yours so what if I am? Ain't nothing wrong with impaling a child. There's everything wrong with impaling a child. I don't approve. Just go sell your mystery meat. Fine. But mark my words, someone will pay for going into my closet. Actually, before you get started, the garbage can needs emptying. Go take care of it. Stupid lunch lady making me do my stupid job. No! The garbage! Well, that was fast. There's no way you took it all the way to the dumpster. Would you relax, woman? I dropped it off in the bathroom. I'll get it after the bell rings. Sheesh. Old broad is just mad. The kids like my food better. It's in the bathroom. Jerome, it's in the bathroom. Well, that didn't go quite as planned. At least you're not dead. That's a relief. What now? I hate to ask this of you, but you need to go get it. The janitor said that it's in the bathroom. What's in it for me? I know I'm asking a lot from you, but just work with me on this. I'll make it worth your while. Fine. I'll go pay off the lunch lady so you can get out. Just hurry back. The janitor will be taking that garbage out shortly after the bell rings. Go pay her off then. Okay, she said she'd let you go out. Go get it. Fine. I don't know, Lily left. But we're not gonna... She's here. We don't got time. 
Let's go to the bathroom. Where's the hall monitor? No hands unlocked. Huh? You, you're not supposed to be in here. I gotta take you to the principal. That is, unless... Well, I'm out of cigarettes. If you had some, I'd be willing to let you off. I have a hall pass. Nice try, little man, but that pass isn't good for lunch. Oh. Monty was selling cigarettes in the morning. Shit. Alright, we gotta go back. Uh, okay. Alright, we're back here. Huh? You, you're not supposed to be in here. I gotta take you to the principal. That is, unless... Well, I'm out of cigarettes. If you had some, I'd be willing to let you off. I do. Hell yeah. Thanks so much, little guy. Go do what you gotta do. Cool, thanks. See you around, little man. See ya. Is this it? Looks like I'm digging through this after all. Get the stupid lazy boy now. Okay, well, let's just go. Because it said something about getting the laser pointing to Jerome. Oh, did the slop give you the run? Sorry about that. Hope it worked itself out. All the other kids are at recess now. Go run along. Okay. He's like right on Jerome's tail. Hey, kid. Come over here. Assignment complete. Try to bring the laser. Jerome briefed me on your little mission. Did you manage to get the laser from the bathroom? Yep. Good. I don't know if you noticed, but the janitor is watching Jerome a little too closely. He looks like he's about to kill him. We gotta do something about it. What do you mean? That old man has been harassing kids for decades. I think it's time we finally got even with him. How do we do that? Don't you? Doesn't he sell you stuff? Yeah, doesn't he sell you stuff? Who doesn't? And when it comes down to it, the principal's kid is far more valuable than an unstable octogenarian the f what is that word? Willing to sell me tools at a cheap price. Good point. What should I do? I'm going to take the laser as collateral for my services here today. He'll get it back when he pays me. Okay, now what? Well, there goes my laser. Jerome gave me this. It's one of his dad's little bugs. Little things tend to pop if they don't like what they hear. Don't worry, I deactivated it. Oh, Nucky gave me one of these earlier. Oh. What do I do with it? You just worry about putting it behind the janitor without him seeing you. I'll handle the rest. Come see me when it's done. Okay. So, get behind the janitor. Should I place the device here? Yeah, why not? There we go. Did you place it? Yep. Excellent. This is going to be good. Now, Jerome. Jerome runs away. Get back here. I ain't done questioning you yet. Oh my god. Jeez, dude. I told you to distract him, not blow him up. Good thing I didn't get that thing back from Nugget. Oh my god, the principal's trying to blow up Nugget. Uh, he had it coming. The janitor just exploded. Yes, he did. They're all so calm about this. The irony here is that there's no one here to clean up the parts. Can we just go inside? Yes, I think that would be for the best. I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring? Uh, I brought a screwdriver. Because he gave me this, and I'm pretty sure we're not supposed to show that. Oh, a screwdriver. That's my favorite drink. The janitor was mentioning how he wishes he hadn't sold his to Monty. Apparently, there's a loose shelf in his closet or something. Yeah, we already figured that out. Okay, who's next? Oh, I'm the only one who has to show and tell? Alright. Well, children, that was a fun little show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all had a fun day today. I'll see you all tomorrow. So nobody talks about the janitor just exploding. It's normal. Alrighty then. Well, kid, I'm impressed. You put up with this whole crazy day just because I told you it'd be worth it. It better be. It is, trust me. It's just a shame it required Monty taking the laser pointer until I pay him back. Either way, you've earned this. What is it? It's a mold for a key to my dad's office. 
you get this made and you can go in there anytime. How can I even get this made? Monty can hook you up. Just bring it to him at the beginning of the day and he'll figure it out for you. Okay then. This is where we part ways, man. You're pretty cool. I'll see you around. Day complete. Hey, I got an achievement. Too cool for school. Items unlocked. Key mold. Continue. I got 50 cents, so I have 250 in my piggy bank. Let's continue. Monday. Again. Okay, I'm gonna pretend surprised. Oh my god, it's Monday again? Although, I know the thing about this game is that it's always Monday. So, oh my god, it's Monday? I am so shook. So, wait. Oh, okay, I have new hints. Okay, so hint five for our character. If you go to the restroom without cigarettes during lunch, the hall monitor will take you to the principal's office. Um, the bucket of blood on the floor of the janitor's closet is perfect for what Cindy is planning. We already did Jerome's mission, so we can just skip over that. Get rid of Jerome during morning time by giving him a yo-yo and then giving the teacher his hall pass. Lily should be eliminated after Bugs and Monty by knocking on the principal's door. A box in the janitor's closet has five bucks in it. Yeah, I figured that out. You need cigarettes. You need to buy cigarettes in the schoolyard. Okay. Well, you need a special item from Jerome and as much money as you can carry to complete Monty's mission. Okay, so the mold was the special item. You can carry five bucks. I doubt a mold's gonna be five bucks. So the next mission I want to do is Cindy. Oh, that means I gotta be mean to Lily, and that sucks. But okay. So... Oh, look, there we go. This is new. This is the mold for a key to the principal's office that I got from Jerome. If I take it to Monty, he should be able to get it made for me for a price. I'll leave it here. So... Oh, those cards! Okay, so I'll also take time to try to collect all the cards. So next episode, we'll be doing Cindy's mission. But until then, goodbye.